Holly was upset that President Obama was reelected. And when she found out Daniel didn't vote, it pushed her over the edge. You're watching the most shocking and informative LRJ TV news. Hello, I'm LRJ. I have a really bad cold, but I said the news cannot wait. So I must update these videos while I have a chance while I still got a voice. Um, today in this particular news clip, uh, this woman decided to run her husband over because he did not vote for Mitt Romney. Uh, let's go. Holly Solomon ran over her husband in a Gilbert parking lot when she found out he didn't vote last week. People are passionate about their politics. She was extremely upset. On Saturday, the pregnant Holly Solomon and her husband Daniel got into a fight inside their vehicle in this Gilbert parking lot. A police report says that Holly was upset that President Obama was reelected. And when she found out Daniel didn't vote, it pushed her over the edge. Investigators say the 28 year old claimed she wanted to scare her husband when he got out of the Jeep. Yeah, at one point he went behind a light pole just so that obviously the vehicle couldn't strike him. He ended up leaving the light pole at one point trying to run away from the pole to a different area. That's when Holly says she hit the gas instead of the brake, running down her husband and pinning him to the ground. Tonight, Daniel Solomon remains in the hospital in critical condition. His wife is here at the Estrella Jail, charged with aggravated assault and reckless driving. Mm, 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 mm. From the looks of her picture and the things that she did, I'm most certain sure that Mitt Romney mentioned her in his 47%. But just for the record, in case she did not really know that, um, his one vote would have not counted. For the record, um, President Obama won the election, um, and uh, um, Florida was still counting votes, and uh, uh, he surpassed Mitt Romney, um, and when the Florida came back, three days later, he won Florida. Um, I'm most definitely sure, ma'am, that uh, his one vote will have not made a damn difference. <laughs> So, with that being said, comment down below and let me know what do you think about her actions and how dumb that was. And in related news, a woman posted on her Facebook page, not another four years with this nigger. I hope this time he get assassinated. We asked her about it again today and she clarified. Are you a racist? No, I'm not. It sounds like you're a racist. It does. And it... And that's what everyone's been telling me. They're like, you know, what you said sounded so racist. And it does, you know, and I take it back. I, if I could erase what I said, I would. I'm LRJ. Rate, comment, and subscribe because you, like you did. I love you all. Peace.